and welcome. I'm Max Wolf, and we are here at Wheels Day 2024. I have just filmed all of that, so if you want to see a walk around of all that, check out the first walk around. But we're going to head into the second side of this place, so let's start filming it. So I'm going to start part two, or the second row, or well, second sector of everything here, off down the bottom here speakers at the top that are playing a lot of music and I think that might cut a lot of this audio but there's quite a few cars in the in the other half of this car park you're gonna have to check that out because there's loads here I haven't seen for a very long time and a lot of new cars very cool so like I said we get 30 seconds in and I'm already chatting to people I'm not complaining I love it that's what makes this scene what it is hopefully you can hear what I'm saying there's a lot of wind here and again if I'm going a bit quick on these cars I said this in the other video I've got to go around it quickly because if I don't go around it quickly I've got a show I want to get to in the afternoon and I won't get to it if I don't get around here quickly and I want to film everything so I've got to keep up on this so as I said it's the chatting with people and it's the people that makes this this one here is for sale I've got a video up on my channel it's a very very cool truck and very sensible price we're part of the skid lids crew here got a lot of paintwork on that you've got gmc cyclone one of very very few in the country very rare very very fast and this is all of the bag shop breakfast meat crew that we did a big big convoy in with this morning and it didn't it got split up a little bit but we had a good convoy check out the tires on this that's that's different is the inside like yeah, maybe it's just the tires custom yeah different though that's a bit different so we'll continue round so like i said i've got to keep on the move today i wanted i would love to film everything individually but it's well I, i'm getting everything in it's just I'm doing it a bit quick. Another one, I didn't realise this was up for sale. Pause there if you want the details. <laughs> nice hot rod that we've seen out. Where did I see that? I'm going to have to have a think on that one. I'm pretty sure I've seen it out before though. And I've just had something come up on my phone, so let me check that. Turns out it was a text from Santa Claus. It'd be very depressing if that is. But I've got to do what I can. Next year I'm probably going to have this full camera system on a gimbal and all that. So next year will be a lot better. So we have cars here from the teddy bear run. We've got a Lambo here. Yeah. This is also seeming to be the muddy part of the venue as thankfully the whole ground didn't turn into this. We got very, very lucky the ground is dry here. But yeah, even more cars here. And looks like all the auto jumble out the back here. I want to have a look in there. Have a look in there. I'm going to finish up on the cars and then I'm going to have a look around there and see what I can find. We've got some banger cars here and some circuit cars. As we now head back into the classics, back into row two of the chaos. It's incredibly busy. The ground is surprisingly dry. It's been a good day. I'm liking this big Ram camper van. It's massive. It's huge. One eagle on the side as well. It's just huge. Got to keep moving around. Like I said, got to do this quick. So I can't focus on anything particularly too long. But another massively high one here. And we've had quite a lot of modern cars enter this year, which I don't, I don't mind. I'm not into modern cars, but I'm learning them. And we've seen one here, we've seen this out New Year's Day, has been down the bag shop before. Big, big motor in it. Very loud. Let me just give you a little spin round here, so you can give a little feel of what it's like here. And 
happened yet. The, the sky is, yeah, we did have a lot of rain earlier. So thankfully, the ground is dry. We're doing good so far. Got to keep moving around. Another one that I've seen on the way in. Some very, very nice cars here today. We're getting around it all. We are getting there. I didn't film it all coming in. I wanted to, but I either film it all coming in or I film it all doing a walk around and I didn't get here early enough to film it all coming in. So we're sticking with the walk around. Hopefully you're enjoying it. And if you're enjoying the walk around so far, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Comment if there's a car you particularly like and it'd be like, yeah, I'll take that home. So far, I've seen some cars I like. There's nothing that's caught my eye and been like, hmm, yeah, I want that. Some nice, nice cars that I like. But I don't think I've found the one of the show for me yet. And I do know what car is here that would be my car on the show. It is a wing car. So I will say that isn't the Soxa Martin Superbird be the car I'll take home. Or my own. I'll see if I can find one that I like. Chaser is it? White Chaser? I don't know modern stuff. Oh yeah, MC underscore white underscore chaser is their social tag, so follow them out. We've got the whole Cries of 300 crew here, the 300 mob. This lot all rolled in together and created a right scene because, well, when, when they show up, they show up in force. So check out how many we have here. Diesel. And I was just saying, we've got a proper lineup here, haven't yeah. we? We actually parked the mob. We actually a proper lineup. We actually a car park. Yeah, I remember the 300 mob, isn't it? Yeah. yeah, yeah, proper lineup. I seen them all coming in. I was like, yeah, that's an entrance. Yeah, 300 mob know how to cruise about. That is some lineup. That is. So we have the old Wolsey here. Very nice. And I can feel the rain coming. I'm glad I was moving round. I have no clue what this is, but I, I like cars that are different. Now, After Dark Automotive here, and they have something very similar to this, which is right over the back, and I'll include that in the end of this video, because now that I have done half the show, I've got a bit more working out how long things are gonna take me to finish filming. But I'm going to have to speed this up even more because this rain is about to tip down on me. I can feel it. It's starting to rain again. I have a feeling everything's going to start leaving. So I'm very glad I went round at the speed that I did. I thought that was open top for a second there, but it's just got a big bed in the back. I was like, oh, don't leave that down in this weather. see on the one on the tires here of these ones this is sort of the muddier area it's not doing great here but pause now if you want to read that so I said, well, let's keep moving a couple of nice little beetles here and a street van huh. with a few little bits and bobs for sale Oh, I've seen this a bag shot. I remember Mr. T. So we are now moving on to the row of the Mopar. Yeah, my car did make it out to the show. No problems. You gotta love a Mopar. It's taken me an hour to do this walk around and get back to my car. That is how long it's taken me to do a walk around here. But we've got even more of the bag shot crew that we came in with. Again, another one for sale here, a 30th anniversary mini. Pause that if you want to read that. And so, obviously, my own Mopar is going to be car of the show, in my opinion. And then there's going to be this, which is the one I'll be taking home. So, except for my car, the 
the Socks of Martin Superb, which I've done videos and all that on, you can check that out on my channel. And the Bling Beast, what else would I be taking home? As I do have a soft spot for these three in this row. Maybe the uh, Aussie Challenger that was in the other row in the first video. That was quite nice. And that was something very unique and something I haven't seen before. So maybe, maybe that. Got a nice Mazda here as the rain is starting to tip it. I can hear something doing what sounds almost like wheel spin somewhere. Hopefully it's not. I think it's just something revving up. But yeah, lots of cars I've seen all over the place. I've seen this one down, Krispy Kremes. And I've seen this, oh, where was it? Bewley, yeah, Bewley. Huge amount of paintwork on this. It's just incredible. Real shame it's a dull day. Because in the sunshine, this is beautiful, beautiful anyway, but in the sunshine, this is gleaming. Even custom door handles, Sides, beautiful. The sun steering wheel with a mirror in the center. It's just crazy. This car has. And now, now the rain's coming down. Another lowered. What's that? Dodge, I think that is. Another Mopar I haven't seen out for a very long time. I don't know if I've actually seen that one out before. I've seen this down back shop recently. There's a lot of different stuff out here this year. It's quite a, uh, quite a play, isn't it? Oh, ooh. Eight. <laughs> yeah, just, yeah. So keep moving around here. Another one we've seen down the breakfast meet. Mega engine in it, big 502. Sounds amazing. Had loads of work done on it. Very, very nice car. As you can see, a lot of people diving for their cars now. It's starting to tip it down. And we have here a school bus. And we have one of the open top pot rods leaving. Yeah, big, big school bus. I don't know if this was the one that was on Brooklyn's American Day. There was one at American Day and I didn't realise you could actually walk on it. And I missed out on that, so I'll be looking out for that this year. So that is pro completed. And we've, like I said, done all of that side and you can now see everyone moving round. As the rain starts to close in, everyone's going to be running for their cars. And there's going to be... There's music playing up there, really so if the audio starts cutting like mutes, that's because of copyright reasons. As you can see, the rain is coming down so much that now even my camera is getting covered. So let's clean that off. He needs to be in with the 300 crew. We've got another one for sale. Check that out. A lot of very, very nice cars as we come to the Moggy. Yeah, it's cool, I like that. It's all right. Another Mustang and another Willis Coupe. Even though it has rained, even though we're at a new venue, we've still got, like I said, just look, just got look at the cars we got here. We've still got real good turnout, real good show. Always got to enjoy seeing people out. And I know this is going very quickly and I'm sort of just skimming over all the cars here, but I've got to because it's taken me over an hour just to get to here. So if I hadn't done it at this speed, I would never have got round. 
but I'm trying to pick out the cars that I personally like, which is mainly the Americans and Mopars. Won't be to everyone's taste, but hey, welcome to my channel. I drive a Mopar. If you don't like it, well, yeah, I drive a Mopar, that's all I'm saying. Yeah! So one, again, I'm not sure on that one, but very nice. We have now got rain coming in. We've got people leaving. I've got to speed up another gear to get around this as we're going to get soaked if not. I can hear a lot of cars starting up and leaving. Thankfully, I have done the vast majority of this show. I'm loving the jacket on that guy. Roadrunner, love it. Very cool jacket. Couple of nice Anglias here, and another another Corvette. I actually quite like the Corvettes. They're quite a nice shape. That and the blue one. I quite like them. So moving on to row five now, row six. We're we're getting round here quite well, and thankfully back onto hard standing. And I really hope that you can hear everything I've been saying because there's been loads of wind and. You know, I've just got to do what I can. We have this chameleon paint Ford here, next to the Beetle, and pipes coming out the side. How cool is that? That feels like deja vu. This feels almost identical to a wagon that we saw over there somewhere, doesn't it? But some very nice cars here. Another couple that we've seen down here, I believe Drop Dead Car Club this lot are. There's going to be a show that they're starting up soon, and there is the flyer for it. Hopefully, I'm going to have to see if I can make it to that one, because there's a new new meet I've been going to. Just started up last month. Uh, the Riverside Cruisers Street, or Riverside Street Cruisers Reunion. And that was a very good show, so it'll be... It's on the same night, so I'm going to have to see if I can get to it. But yeah, Drop Dead Car Club, very cool lot. See them out of bag shot and all over the place. I'm liking this a lot. Big skull on the front, and even little tiny skulls. That's very cool. I like that. And we have the purple, pink, purple chameleon uh, Chevy here. <laughs> I'm starting to lose my voice. I've been talking over this loads. And it's probably all been scrubbed away by all of the wind that's going to be over the top of this video, sadly. What I'll do next year, next year I was at the camera shop yesterday, looking at cameras. Yeah, I thought Mopars were expensive. You try getting into professional film equipment. And I thought this was, is it Stratisfaction? No, I think it's Satisfaction. That's what I thought this was when I saw it at the first, but no, it is not the winged one. But still very cool. I obviously I I'm only being 20-ish. I haven't seen all of the classic cars, but I'm assuming Time Warp 2. This must be one of the classics. Would have been around in the 70s and 80s, I guess. Don't know this one. Like I said, unfortunately I haven't got the experience of it. If I just said something twice, that is the gimbal, and I was real. My phone's just said 20% battery left. I started this with like 80% battery. Yeah, my gear's running out of battery now. My gimbal's flashing away at me. I've been on the go all day. And we have the home of DGP Photography here. I'm hiding, Max. We have Darren hiding in here. He's, 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 he's gone rain phobic. He's a fair weather photographer. <laughs> no, he's just been soaked out here earlier. But check him out. He's been doing photos all day. Dedication for you. Yeah. It's been a very, very good day. As I am now stepping into even more mud. This has thankfully not been the entire day. But we've got to move around, we're down, moving around, um, running along battery, area, let us keep going. Them. We were diverted because Charlie had suffered a traumatic massive tyres on the back. Um, Volkswagen cab here, the well he's underneath, you can just see 
what we're Don't dealing with today, weather wise. Not days, the Corvette, um, not the camper van. It's been busy. Um, I've been enjoying it. Phones uh, dying, uh, running out of battery. I'm doing my best. We're almost, almost round. We've got another six rows to do. I've been on the go for well over an hour. And I've said it before, and I'll say it again. This video might be fast, and I'm not getting the cars in very much, but I've got to get everything in. If I don't do it at this speed, I'll never get it all in. We have Stefan here, <laughs> Krispy Kreme's member, always down at the shows when he can be. It's, like I said, it's the people that make the shows. The cars are great, but it's all of the people that make it so much better. And another one first I have seen here, the Midas. Yeah, first one of them I've seen today. Another camper here. As I'm now getting a load of texts come through on my phone, and funnily enough, it's actually from this WhatsApp group. <laughs> and if you know that WhatsApp group, you'll know we can't repeat what they're saying. So, phone calls and catching up with people. Busy, busy day. We've got to keep going. Like I said, rain's coming down. Whew, it's going to be a good day. And another one, 71 Roadrunner. Only one I've seen in the show so far. How you doing? It's been a busy, busy day. And the Bonneville here, again, only one I have seen today. Actually, I've seen a couple of chargers. I, I should know. So far, I haven't seen any other chargers. I say that, and there's another one. <laughs> so we're now in the Ford Pop Row. When we were on our convoy in, we had a brief stop off at the petrol station. And we've seen all of this lot meeting up. We're hopefully going to cruise in with them, but it wasn't to be. Everything went a little haywire. But we're now moving round to... Oh, I've lost count of the rows now. But it's getting very, very good times. Hopefully my phone won't run out of battery. Yeah, another one I haven't seen except for the Brighton run. I'm liking this. This is very, very high quality and very nice. Show quality vehicles that are coming out in the rain. These got gear. It's very nice. Like the rear uh, wrist on as well. It's nice. So I keep going round now to Mopar Alley. This is all of the Krispy Kremes lot that came in. Big, big convoy in. Looks like we've had a couple of people stuck in the mud here. We're doing the best we can. Another one that's the only one here I've seen. Again, all Krispy Kreme cars, all have come down. We've seen this one out at bar 54 quite a few times. Yeah. So we're getting stopped off quickly to check out the V8 on this. Like I said, people I know get extra inclusions into the video as you do. Oh, check that out. That's nice, isn't it? It fits in there nicely. Yeah. Yeah, I'm liking that a lot. That's cool. It's, it's quality when you know you can walk around a show and you know it's going to end up in the video, get the special presentation. Yeah, that's cool. Like that. Right, I better go on. I'm gonna get soaked otherwise. So I'll catch you guys yeah, up in a bit. Fun, mate. As we have RC car as well. <laughs> right, I'll catch you guys up in a bit. Yeah, mate. Yeah, right. So, like I said, stopping off, catching up with people. It's always good to see. And I haven't seen this one in person before. Again, we've had two cars that are almost the same colour as mine. Green charger. Actually, no, have I? No. I might have seen this one. There's a person that has, let's say, let's go for a nice estimate of 11 cars. And they have one very similar to that. They have all the black hoods on. I don't think that's theirs. So there's another green one. I haven't seen that before. But I am worried what my phone battery is doing. It is running low. My gimbal's flashing away at me. But we haven't got many rows left to do. Nice Corvette here. I do like the Corvettes. I like cars with big body kit on them. It's all different. 
this is going to take me forever to edit, forever to get out, but hopefully there's no loads of wind over this, that's what I'm worried about. We'll see. I'm enjoying it regardless, at least I'm actually looking around the cars once. And we have this Defender here with all of the kit. Working our way around. Another green Mopar here. <laughs> All green Mopars for you. Uh, would you like to come and see me, please? Uh, you'll find it. Alright. So, first time I've actually had to get through people. It's been a busy day. Not as busy as Rush Mall was last year, but we had, we had everything. It was Will's Day at Rush Mall. The weather was perfect. Last year had everything going for it. Previous year to that, it was way too hot. Couldn't even really leave the car. It was boiling. This year, it is monsoon on us. So, yeah, we've got 50-50. Now, if the video starts cutting audio, that will be because there's music playing. Hopefully, with me speaking over this, I can avoid its detection and we'll see how that goes. But we will do what we can. If it does cut audio, what I'll do is I'll just chuck some uh, non-copyright stuff over it so you haven't got to listen to just nothing. We'll keep moving around. Hopefully it's not picking up the music. It shouldn't be at this point, hopefully. I'm worried that my phone is starting to give out a little bit. Here's one I've never seen before. Completely different to anything we see out of the shows. Haven't seen this before, which is surprising. It's hard to miss. That's very cool. So let me keep going around. I've got to speed this up. The phone's running low on battery. I must be over an hour of footage now. This video must be reaching half an hour by now, surely. So I said, I did the first half, now I'm on the second half. I must be running out of footage and space here. We're getting round though. So, more catching up with people. It has been a very, very good day. First time I've stopped for more than two minutes for like the last half an hour. It's been a good, good day. So we've got, we got food stalls here. We've got all sorts of water jumble. I really haven't had a chance to look around all that much. Again, something else. I've never seen this one out before. I like the color matching interior. Very, very nice. So look at the back. I've got to keep this going. I think this may be, have I done it? This may be the last row. And to prevent coming back on stuff that's going to be slightly not video friendly, I guess, we've got these massive rams here. The Ford rams, we've got the war one. Yeah, very big trucks. Seen a couple of them down at, I can think of it, North Wheel, that was it, swap me. Yeah, good times. I said I'll get out to all of the shows. I've done probably oh, 20, maybe 30 shows this year already. It's been busy, very, very busy. 
and I've started doing photos and I haven't managed to take really any because I've been going around doing all this. But the guy back down to the section that now has all of the all of the music, so we will see how this goes. But this is a bit different, isn't it? How cool is this? I do like I do like the customs. I do like the customs, they are cool. As the wind's now blowing me away. Saw this out at Riverside Cruises the other night. We've seen this now on New Year's Day. Uh, where was it? I can't remember now. Slipped my mind. I know where it was New Year's Day though. Got some tractor pulls over there. A load of. Uh, what are they? Stickers? Badges? I've got to have a look over there. Yeah, good, good oh, thankfully they've stopped on the music. So let me quickly get down here. White American cars. That's W-I-G-H-T-I-E. The Isle of Wight are having their white So let me go left here. On Sunday the 30th of June. Now, it may be a bit of a slip for you to get to the Isle of Wight. Um, and there's my view uh, of the ground. Right on the south tip of the island, a chail wreck. Um, but uh, they're doing a deal with the um, is it Red Funnel line that uh, goes out there. Um, the guy is organising it all is Ken. Um, 0770 0770-8410-929. And that's the 30th of June, Sunday the 30th of June, White Wheels, and it's open from 10 a.m. So I and, think uh, you can get a deal I have done it. On a boat. I've done a full walk around on Wheels Day 2024. So we're going to add on to the end of this more of section one. So I have done a video that shows off literally everything that is here but this one i started there this row has now fully materialized over the time i was doing the walk around so i'm going to add this into the end we'll add this one into the end of part two or well yeah i'm not i'm not going to i'm not going to stretch it and do three parts maybe i'm good i don't know we'll see how it goes but we are going to shoot off i guess fairly soon over to Namco's because that's going to be very very busy that's going to be just as good and then hopefully if I get a little bit of time I might be able to run around do a couple of pictures <laughs> and yeah we're going to continue the good times But we're going through. My phone's just come up saying 10% battery left. We're running low. How about the hell? We got mini and full size. How cool is that? We have, I've seen this out a couple of times. Big old truck, seen that down. Red or Cruise, I'm pretty sure. That was the last time I've seen it. Surprisingly, there's a lot of cars here, but I haven't seen out of many shows before and it's surprising there's a lot of cars that are at the Red Hill Cruise I haven't seen here so yeah it's normally Red Hill Cruise gets everything same with the Hayride the Hayride gets a lot of different cars as well that we haven't seen before but yeah hopefully I can get around and do a couple of photos I would like to get some photos in I've started doing photos now and it also helps me do a thumbnail to something like this because I've got to work out the best, best sort of motors to use. Haven't seen this Dodge before. I said a lot of uh, sort of modern cars. And it's all lost on me. I don't know anything about the modern cars at all. And the fair weather photographer has come out of hibernation. Out of hibernation. <laughs> It stopped raining, so I'm out. Hello! It's probably going to be windy as anything. The whole yeah. walk around probably can't hear anything I've been going on about, but 
I have finished a full walk around of Wheels Day 2024. You've done all of it? I've done all of it. I've only just finished. Well, I've got this one to do, but that's well, all I keep seeing is him running around. I just, he's got too much energy. I'm go, I haven't eaten breakfast yet. I'm getting my steps in. Henry! What do you think of it? It's good. I prefer Rushmore, but it's good. Yeah, that's good. But, casting, we need to move on, don't we? We need to move to... to well, at least the show's still going. That's the main thing. Yeah, 49 years. Well, that's going to be windy. Oh, that's going to be very windy. That's going to be very windy. We're trying it. Next year, I'll have it on camera, gimbal, uh, microphones. We'll work it out for next year. We're here. We're here. So the wind is picking up. We've got more cars to do. I think I've seen this dust around before. I'm going to get around here as I am running out of time. It's half 11. I've been on the go non-stop. It's been a very good Wheels Day. It's been a very good time. Like I said, like an hour and a half this has taken to get around here. Maybe two hours. It's been a long old time. But we've been trying. We've got all the footage in. Starting to rain again. Yeah, it's been, been a good time. So I am now, I think, what I'll do, I'm going to go around. I'm going to go on the outside right. Get the cars in over there. Cars in over here. And there might be some more down there, so I'll add them in if they're there. So we've got the NSRA stand here. Yeah, it's been a good day. Get another one we've seen out at... Hmm. I think we're at last seen this, but it has a little doggy. As the wind has picked up again, the rain has started again. Anyone who is interested in their photo coming in, there's the Mopar. And if you want to see your photo, check out the website as they seem to have photographed everyone coming in. How oh, cool. So, busy, busy day. Sun's coming out now. We have even more still turning up. It's been very, very good. We've been at Wheels Day all day, and now we are heading off to Namco. So let's go. Yeah. 